y'all as i'm laying here and i'm just like i'm just talking to father and i'm just i'm pouring my heart out to him and i'm just like you know right now you know i'm very open real honest transparent with you guys right now i'm at a time in my life where i all i want is his will for my life whatever that looks like that's all i want right and so when his fruit is not being shown like for example say say i got a job and um I, i'm like did i make this this and that's another thing once you're asking yourself did i make this decision um based on my own understanding or or did god is this god approved like that's the step to know that you are growing deeper and more anchored in christ if you're just questioning something like that you understand so when i start to question stuff like that okay father says by it's fruit you would know by their fruit you would know them so people places and things okay so like for example that same example if if you know the fruit is showing that it's it's not correlating with his plan for my life if it's not correlating with my purpose that he spoke to me on if it's not correlating with who with my relationship with him and who and who i'm growing into right my identity in christ then it's not for me and it could be like i said something like a job it could be a, a partner it could be friends it could be anything right so i'm just sharing a, a vulnerable spot of my life right now you guys get into an atmosphere where you're saying father what is your will for my life if something that's in my life right now or someone or something that's that's not of your will for my life father remove it remove them and do it in good standing do it in peace but father i don't want anything attached to me that has nothing to do with what you written down that was specifically for and put your name there you understand this is very vital y'all i was just here shedding tears and host said tell the world tell, share this with the world tell them th the same thing because we we might think oh we're doing good and we we following our dreams and stuff but your dreams what you think is your dreams might not be god's will for your life and what's what what is it what is it profit for you to gain with your so-called dreams and lose your soul at the end of it all because this roommate this is not our last destination this is not real so what is it profit for you to do everything you feel like you want to do and your dreams? But that's not really what God wills for your life. Get into an atmosphere where God can really reveal to you what his will for your life is. And I'm telling you, the desires of your heart will change. He will change it right into his desires for you. This is so important, y'all. I love you so much. Keep me in prayer. Bless up yourself. You're done with the team,